cars. So, yeah. Hybrid cars, they use two or more sources of power, including electricity, so they float less. So, like, this is how a car works. Um, this is the electric battery, and that's the engine. So sometimes it uses only the battery or only the engine, but usually it's better if it only uses the battery. So the blue is the battery. So the battery doesn't pollute, but the engine is like normal cars, so they pollute. Um, the cars can also have other types of energy, like solar energy and engine, or gas, or stuff like that. Yeah. Um, your uh, public transportation, if you take public transportation, it's going to be a lot better, because even though one bus pollutes more than one car, if there are 30 people in a bus, it's way better than 30 individuals taking their own car. So, their own cars, so that's going to be 30 cars, or one bus. There is another invention, the catalytic converter. You put them in the car, like, uh, I think near the front right here. So you put the catalytic converter, and it takes all the gases that are going to go out into the atmosphere. They go through um, a mesh that's like a beehive, sort of. And if you unroll it, it's going to be the size of a football field, so it's really <coughs> And it's only about this big, yeah. the mesh part. So it goes through that, and then a lot of the dangerous emissions that it would have emitten, emitted are taken away, so only it's not that dangerous anymore. So only a little, like a little percentage of what would have gone out comes out, really comes out. And there's a type of cement that was invented. It's decontaminating calcium. It was launched in 2006 on the French market. So they put it near the, uh, the uh, streets or the you know, highways that there's a lot of cars go past there. And so there's a lot of air pollution. So they put the cement there on in buildings, and then the cement takes in the pollution, and it accelerates the um, the cement the chemical reaction that breaks down the pollutants. So it's, it breaks down the pollutants a lot faster, and so it sucks in the pollutants and it breaks them down. Kind of like a tree.